scared to make a killing. And I'm like Ellen, big sweet and little sweet cold chilling. Drugs me and Sunny, we be getting money. <laughs> This inmate 348710004. I remember a young man, he was 10 years younger than me from Miami. He stepped to me, he said, Unk, where you live at? I say my family live in Miami Gardens. He said, um, don't wear that wedding ring when you go out there. Because if some of my hitters out there see you, they might run down on you. Then he said, it'd probably be better, Unc, if you move to Broward. And so I'm, I'm listening to him because I'm not going to challenge him so he can get on the phone and find out where my family stay and make his word bond. So I was just listening to him. I say, well, okay, man, um, I, I, won't, I won't wear my ring. I'll take my ring off when I'm in Miami Gardens. And um, I say, I, when I talk to my family again, I'll consider... Um, seeing if they could find a place in Broward to stay. Because this generation is, is different from my generation and the generation that came after us. So I think we, I look at our generation and I say, we really messed our, our, the next generation of our children up. The way we, handled it in the streets. But when I think about it, it's a generation that came after us and it's the generation that came after them that's a violent generation. So when people looked at my generation, you know, just like when I was young, I looked at Bo Dilly and Ike and Bunky Brown and Ricky, Rick Brownie. You know, you know, they had the hustlers mentality. You know, you know, none of them were known to be killers, but they were known for getting a lot of money. And I think that the youngsters that came after us that looked up to us like we looked up to them, they looked at us too as a as a hustling generation, dudes that love to drive around in the birds, you know, with the boom in them, you know, maybe with our girl on the side. You know, and it, and it wasn't really a violent generation. So he ran that stuff down to me and I was like, okay, man, you know, cause I don't, I've been, I've been away from the streets for 15, 20 years. I don't know. You know, I've been hearing about all the violence that been going on in the streets. So I, you know, I just went along with what he said. And I remember also when I got out, a hitter stepped to me. So I was doing this function at our school in the evening time. And so I noticed two brothers walking across the street towards me. So one of them stepped closest to me and the other one stood like behind him. And he was like, oh, you done got out, huh? I know you done dig that money up. Yo, I know all about you. I used to be back on your, I used to be on your line back in the day. I know you done came out here and dig that money up, huh? And he was, he was kind of like passive aggressive. And so I, I know what that is. I understand that, that language. So I'm looking at his body language. So in my mind, I think he the one that have the gun. I think he's the one um, that's more so in control of the other guy. So I'm like, nah, man, um, bro, I've been down 22 years. Ain't nobody got no money the last 22 years while they in prison. 
And so he just insisted, nah, unk, I know you done dig that money up. I know you got that bag. And so I want to tell you this lesson about thoughts and energy. And so since I've been raised, you know, I have a high vibration of energy, which is positive. Negative neg or negativity is a lower vibration. And so sometimes we allow people with lower vibrations to bring us down from our high vibrations down to the lower vibration. And the lowest of vibration is physical force or gunplay. That's the lowest form of vibration. And so understanding this, even though you may think something in your mind and you might not speak it, but thoughts have vibration too. So if I would have been if I would have, have had negativity and violence in my mind, it would have came down to his vibration and then it would have caused a conflict. And so while my brother was talking to me, I was still looking at him in love and in peace. Scared to make a killing, and I'm like Ellen, big sweet and little sweet cold chilling. Drives me and Sunny, we be getting money. 